In this video, you'll learn how to create a funeral slideshow. This tutorial will be helpful for those who would like to honor the memory of their loved one or for funeral homes that look to provide this kind of service to their clients. To create a tribute video for a relative or a friend, we'll be using SmartShow 3D, an easy-to-master funeral slideshow maker. Once you run SmartShow 3D, you'll have two options. One is to make a slideshow from scratch, and the second is to pick one of the slideshow in five minutes templates. Let's go with the second option. We'll choose this graceful template. Now add your pictures. You can either add a picture at a time or import the whole folder. In case you need to rotate some of the pictures or crop them, you can do it right in the wizard like this. Now let's add a soundtrack to our memorial slideshow. You can either go with a track of your own or pick a tune from the software's library. There are over 200 tracks you can choose from that are divided by genre and tempo. We'll go with a soothing classical piece. Click Done and preview your project. Now we have the basis for a touching tribute slideshow. Let's make it more personal and heartfelt. First, let's change the duration of some of the shortest slides so that the slideshow would linger longer on the pictures of your loved one. Set a new duration of the slide by changing the value here. Our slideshow for a funeral needs the opening title card. Let's make one. Just right-click the first slide and choose Edit Text. Now type in the new text for the title card. Add a few words about your loved one to your funeral slideshow. You can insert any text to any slide you want. To do that, hit Edit Slide. Click Add Layer and choose the Text option. Browse through the available styles and pick the one that would complement the mood of your slideshow. Type in the text. If you prefer a personalized design, you can adjust its size, font, style, and color with a few clicks. Now position your text on the slide. If you want this text to appear gracefully, apply a fade-in effect to it. Switch to the Animation tab and hit Layer Fade-in. We'll pick one of the gradients. Let's have a look at the result. Looks very delicate. Now let's add a few more slides of your own design. Drag and drop any picture you want to the storyboard. Get rid of the black bars by right-clicking the image and hitting Stretch Photo. Now let's animate the picture with some elegant effect. Switch to the Animation tab. Choose a subtle effect that won't steal the focus away from the photo. You can go either with a Ken Burns animation or an old film effect. Let's apply a smooth panorama effect. While under the Animation tab, pick the Pan and Zoom option. Choose the Motion Path for your slide and apply it. If your friend's or relative's life was filled with exciting events, present them in the form of a collage. Switch to the Add tab and hit Collages. Drag and drop the option you like to your project 
and fill it with pictures. Let's preview the result. Want to make your funeral slideshow even more refined? Then decorate your photos with elegant frames. Pick the slide you want to embellish, click Edit Slide, highlight the picture, then move to the Layer tab. Hit Select Frame and choose the border that would complement the photo. Adjust its size and color and preview the result. If you are using the deceased one's old pictures, you can give them a retro flare with various filters. Once on the Layer tab, open the built-in Photo Editor and switch to the Effects tab. There you'll find dozens of photo filters you can use to make your memorial slideshow not only heartfelt, but also beautiful. In order to make your video tribute calm and meditative, you'll need to use transitions between slides. Switch to the Transitions tab and look through the selection of various effects. Replace the default transitions with those that will suit the bittersweet mood of your slideshow. Go with tranquil gradients, smooth curtain wipes, or turn your memorial video into a book with page turn effects. You can change the duration of the transitions to make your slideshow more placid. Your tribute slideshow wouldn't be complete without you and other people saying final goodbyes to the one who has passed away. Move to the Music tab and click Voice Comments. Record yourself using your PC's microphone, then add your comments to the timeline wherever you feel they fit. Make sure to turn the music down for the time your voice comments play. Use audio points to do that. Add at least three audio points by right-clicking the music waveform, then create a valley for the duration of your voice recordings. Now let's have a brief look at our creation. This looks like a proper way to say goodbye and honor the one who went gently into that good night. It's now time to export your funeral slideshow. Hit the Create Video button. Save your slideshow as a video for TV if you plan to watch it privately at home with your dear and near. Optimize your video for Facebook or YouTube if you choose this way to share your slideshow with the rest. Alternatively, you can burn your video to DVD so that the funeral house can play it during the ceremony. And this is it! Now you know how to make a touching slideshow for a funeral to honor your late friend or relative. Use this knowledge to make a slideshow that will keep the memories of this person forever alive.